ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Alan Beatty. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the 2016 North American International Auto Show. What a great way to kick off the new year, and welcome to Detroit. We have several government officials here with us today, including Senators Debbie Stabenow, Gary Peters, and Tom Carper. Thank you all for being here today. At Chevrolet, we are building our global Chevy brand, and Find New Roads continues to be our unifying philosophy, our North Star on our journey. We made tremendous headways on every front in 2015. And our market share here in the US proves that out. Chevrolet had the highest, I repeat, the highest retail share gain of any full-line manufacturer in the US. And our brand opinion and consideration have risen to record levels. Make no mistake, winning is about having industry-leading products. Our 2015 mantra here in Detroit was five in 15, and that is now a reality, and you, the media, are definitely taking notice. Camaro won Motor Trend Car of the Year and Car and Drivers 10 Best. Volt was named Green Car of the Year. And for the second year in a row, Colorado picked up Motor Trend Truck of the Year with the new Colorado diesel. We're also committed to delivering the best technologies and making them available right across our lineup, not just on a few select models like many of our competitors. Technology like 4G LTE Wi-Fi, Apple CarPlay, and Android Auto. Our entry into new segments has also added plus sales and market share. I'm talking about vehicles like the Chevy Trax, which joins the biggest portfolio of crossovers and SUVs in the business. And Colorado, our mid-sized truck in our very successful three-truck Chevy strategy. When you put it all together, Chevrolet offers the widest range of cars, trucks, and crossovers in the industry. And of course, there's our important dealer partners who provide the highest sales and service satisfaction of any full-line manufacturer, according to JD Power. So as we enter into the new year, we have tremendous momentum but I believe that Chevy is just getting started. The all-new 2016 crews will arrive in dealer showrooms this spring. First introduced in 2009, Cruise quickly became our best-selling passenger car worldwide, and it remains so today. With 3.8 million units sold, Cruise has redefined Chevrolet for customers right around the world. Here in North America, more than a third of cruise buyers are new to the Chevrolet brand. The all-new 2016 cruise builds on that success and allows people everywhere around the world to experience a new, fresh Chevrolet. And here in the US, customers will soon experience a whole new kind of cruise. Let's take a look.
The all-new cruise hatchback takes everything that's great about our new sedan and makes it even more sporty. It also takes Chevrolet into a new segment to further expand our portfolio here in the US. Like the sedan, it's larger, it's lighter, and it's more efficient than today's cruise. Plus, it's extremely nimble and fun to drive. Both the sedan and hatch offer midsize woominess in a compact package. The new cruise hatch offers one of the largest interior cargo areas in the market, with more than 47 cubic feet of cargo room. Customers will also drive with true confidence, knowing that the new cruise offers segment-leading crash avoidance technologies, like side blind zone alert and rear cross traffic alert features that are truly rare in this segment. You know, Chevrolet has a rich history in product innovation. We at Chevrolet believe in the power, the true power of ingenuity. And truly as a team, we believe that we are finding new roads. Perhaps the one Chevrolet that best exemplifies this true commitment is the groundbreaking new electric vehicle, the Bolt EV. A year ago, we showed you the Bolt EV concept that promised great range and great value for money, a combination thought to be unobtainable. Ladies and gentlemen, now just one year, and I repeat, just one year later, we are proud to present to you today the Chevrolet Bolt EV. everyone. With more than 200 miles per charge and a cost of around $30,000 after federal incentives, the Bolt EV is truly the first EV that cracks the code of long range at an affordable price. Some may think they saw the entire story when we introduced the Bolt EV in, S in Las Vegas last week, but there is much, much more. To tell you the rest of the story, here's Mark Rice. Thanks, Mary. And good, good morning, everybody. It was a great, great week at CES. And, and as Mary said, exactly one year after we showed the Bolt EV concept right here, we now have the production version on this stage. This is our first architecture designed specifically for electric vehicles since the legendary EV1. And when it hits the road later this year, there will be nothing else out there like it. In addition to breaking new ground in affordable, long-range electric driving, the Bolt EV is also practical and a lot of fun on the road. The electric drive unit features a new, high-capacity electric motor developed by us right here at General Motors. With 266 foot-pounds of torque, 200 horsepower, and a final drive ratio of 7 to 1, the Bolt EV accelerates from zero to 60 in less than seven seconds. Now combine that with a low center of gravity made possible by our new battery configuration, and Bolt EV performs more like a sports sedan than a small crossover. Drawing upon more than 1.3 billion miles of electric vehicle experience, our battery chemistry engineers worked with LG Chem to come up with an all-new cell to deliver more than 200 miles of range. 
All of this performance comes at an industry-leading sell price of $145 per kilowatt hour. The battery pack spans the entire floor from the front footwell to the rear seat back. It contains 288 cells that are about four inches high and 13 inches wide. The low profile design enabled the vehicle structure team to maximize interior space. A new nickel rich chemistry in the lithium ion cell provides improved thermal resistance. That allows more efficient packaging of the cooling system to keep the battery operating at its optimum temperature. And using the optional DC fast charging system, the battery can be charged to provide 90 miles of range in about 30 minutes. At full recharge, which is rarely required, takes about nine hours with a standard onboard charger connected to a 240 volt service. The Bolt EV is a car designed for people to use every day. So maximizing the interior space was a very high priority. By integrating the battery into the floor, we created a flat open cabin that comfortably accommodates up to five passengers with more than 94 cubic feet of passenger volume. And large windows all around contribute to the spacious feel while upright seating positions, similar to an SUV, offer customers panoramic vision. And shift-by-wire controls and a flat floor allow the designers to open up the space between the console and the instrument panel as a convenient storage area for a purse or a briefcase. Bolt EV can also carry cargo when necessary. With a fold-flat rear seat, a large, wide liftgate opening, it's easy to load items in and out of the vehicle. And as Mary mentioned last week, the Bolt EV features advanced connectivity technologies that enhance and personalize the driving experience. Now, most of those features are available through the large, customizable 10.2-inch touchscreen. That's bigger than an iPad Air. An enhanced MyLink system offers Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, and you can access our surround vision feature that provides a bird's eye view of the immediate surroundings in the car. We're also offering an innovative new wide angle rear camera mirror. And using a, a rear facing camera, the mirror shows a full wide angle view of what's behind the vehicle without the obstructions of pillars, people, or cargo. It's simple. It's innovative, and it makes the car easier and safer to drive. It's exactly this kind of innovative thinking and spirit that we've infused all the way throughout the car. Our designers really took advantage of the electric-only architecture to develop a unique, forward-looking design that pushes Chevrolet's signature cues in new directions. The Bolt EV will be built right here at our GM Orient Assembly facility beginning later this year. Now, I'd like to bring Mary and Alan back on stage, as well as the people who really made this car happen, our chief engineer, Pam Fletcher, and chief designer, Stuart Norris. So thank you all for being here. Now, please come take a closer look at this groundbreaking car. Thank you very much.